so i really love this area i really love this space it is so i'm so in tune with it hi lovelies welcome back to my channel luxury taste my name is shay faith if you are new here um i will be doing a vanity tour today of my cute cute little vanity i also will be sharing my favorite makeup products and my most used items if you're new here don't forget to subscribe join the family you'll love it here i promise and let's get into the video and i hope you enjoy so my vanity i honestly love it so much it's my desk slash vanity so i sit here to do my videos i sit here to edit i sit here to do my makeup um sometimes i just sit here to listen to music or if i'm like just trying to get in a good mind space this is where i sit at to just you know be mindful and do what i gotta do First and foremost, my vanity is from Ikea. The mirror came from Ikea and the desk itself. I'm not exactly sure of the name, but I will definitely have everything linked down in the description box for my bigger pieces that I'm showing. So let's start with everything that's on top of my vanity. This is from H&M Home and it is so cute. I love this vase. It is just so aesthetically pleasing. It's like a clay and these are fresh flowers. I usually try to keep fresh flowers in my room or in my house just to give me that, honestly, it just makes me feel like a woman. I just love pretty flowers. I try to get different ones each time and on a weekly basis before they die. So that is that. So this is my perfume collection. I just got this little tray from Amazon. It is so cute, I love it. I used to have my make, um, I used to have my perfume sitting in the bathroom on my little spinning vanity thing, but someone told me actually that you weren't supposed to keep your perfumes in the bathroom. So I put it on here. I actually love it. It makes my vanity top look so much more glamorous and it displays my scent nicely. So this is the only thing on a regular basis that I keep on top of my vanity. I usually keep my speaker up here and then uh, you know to get my vibes going when I'm doing my makeup I have to play music every time I do and plus I have it up here so my kids can't get it because they be trying to break my stuff and at the top drawer I just have like my cute little dainty jewelry and like my brooch and just like some cute little hair clips just very dainty girly stuff this is like an anklet I might put this on today. Oh my gosh, I forgot all this stuff is in here. <laughs> Some little cute hoops. So I keep my smaller jewelry up in this compartment. So this drawer holds my watches um, and my earrings, some of my bigger earrings. And this is in here because it is so broke and it's I'm so sad about it. Like, look at the disappointment. And I know you can fix it, I just have not fixed that yet. So I keep it up here and like I said again, so my kids won't get it because I think they did that in the first place. Third drawer has my lip pencils and like lip products. It has a few eyebrows and eye items in here, but basically just all the little things that you can write with like in the pencil form are in this drawer. Favorite red lip pencil is from MAC and it's the color Cherry. I always outline my, li my lips with this when I use red lipstick. And please, if you use any colored lipstick, please, please outline your lips. Please guys, it just looks so much more clean. And what else in here do I use most often? I also have a brown, is this nutmeg or brown? Well, either way, the brown in the nutmeg color in this NYX pencil is so bomb, at least for like my lips. <laughs> Cause I have dark, I have like a dark upper lip. Oh, actually the lip one I have on now is, which one is that? Oh no, not this one, what is it called? This one. This is, such, no this isn't it either. Where is that lip pencil I have on? Is this it? Okay, maybe this is it. This is cork. This is such a good color. It's like a nice brown neutral color from MAC too, guys. So bomb. To outline your lips and put gloss on, that's what I have on right now. Drawer, I have my big glosses and stuff. So, like the Fenty. Oh my gosh, I haven't used this in so long. The Stunna lip paint. Yes, uncensored. I need to... I need somewhere to go to wear this. I saw someone in a makeup tutorial use this not too long ago and I was like, dang, I missed this color. I need to wear this out. But I really don't wear much of these, honestly, no more. I'm. This is probably my most used item in here and this is my matte gloss. I reach for this in a lip pencil almost every time I do my makeup. Sometimes I'll you know, throw this on because it's not really colored. Um, this is one of my favorite products. And 
most of, most of this other stuff I don't really use a lot, but I have it in here because I bought it. Like this is Anastasia NYX. I love these little um, matte glosses though. These are so bomb. And yeah, that's what's in this drawer. This light strip is from Ikea also. The person that originally bought me this vanity bought it to go on the mirror, like to put it around the, the perimeter. And that is super cute, but this isn't a very light light. Like this is as light as it goes. And I honestly just like it to kind of set the mood on my vanity like this. So I keep it right there because I feel like it just sets the mood. I haven't tried to put it around here because I honestly can't even see, like this is how blind I am guys. I have glasses and contacts. I can't even see my face when I'm in this mirror. So it's like too far away. So I barely even use this mirror to do my actual makeup. I actually use a handheld mirror. So let's get into the drawers. Sure, you know it could be pretty plain and pretty boring. Ikea's furniture is honestly to, you know, get it to have like the basic look and then you just vamp it up and switch it up how you like it. So uh, this came with just like little white wood pegs and I actually found these cute, cute little um, door pulls from Hobby Lobby. They were like five or six dollars a piece and I'm so glad I found them. They match my aesthetic so perfectly and like that was just so bomb to like find. Honestly don't wear a lot of makeup. I'm honestly just like a foundation type person with lashes and you know a lip. I rarely do my eyes. If I do it's just like a brown tone over my eyes. So I have my brushes in here and these little containers are from Target. They were like a dollar a piece and I love it because you can hold more in your vanity, especially if you have a smaller vanity like me. Um, like this works perfectly for me. I love it. I don't mind this size at all. Blender is wet right now so that's why it's right here. And Beauty Blender Hack. I put this thing in a cup of water with like a few dots of Dawn dish soap and it was so clean. All you have to do is wring it out and maybe do it one more time. I had my beauty blender so clean, I was shocked. Anywho, this is from Target also, these little containers. And this is my most used products right here. I keep it in the front, whatever I use the most. This is my NARS makeup, Make It Dewy by Milani and my Fenty primer and I use this foundation every day. This one is too dark for me right now. I'm in the shade Car Caracas, I guess. And it's too dark for me right now because it's winter, so I need to get a, a lighter shade. And this is the Fenty Pro Filter Soft Matte. And I honestly don't like this that much. I wanna find a more hydrating one because it is winter right now. And then this stuff is so bomb, I love that. And then just in here is more products. I have like some oil, some body glitter. This is my most used mascara. For my brows, I use the Anastasia brow pencil in the color medium brown. Love this, this is a staple, staple item for me. This is what I use the most. And if you don't have the clear duo, what are you doing? I was using this one for so long and I was like, this this stuff stinks and it sucks. This is so bomb. This like helped me do my lashes so much easier. And then I, I use this daily under my eyes, under my brows, and this is in the color medium dark too, but this is pretty bomb. My other thing that I use under my brows usually would be this MAC Pro Concealer, Pro Longwear Concealer. And this is in NC45. This is a staple. I have had this little bottle for so long. Like it lasts for so long. It's finally gone. And if you keep your items from MAC, um, you can get a free lipstick. So I like keep my old bottles back here. The ones I need to like get rid of or the stuff I just don't use much, I keep back here. Some blushes from MAC. I used to love MAC. I am a MAC stan. I haven't been there in so long though. But I love MAC. And then this is just like primers for under eyes or highlighters for, you know, your face. But these things came in so clutch. At first, um, I didn't have these and my stuff was kind of just all over the place. But these little containers are so nice. This one, I just have a powder from MAC, a Fenty um, highlighter, and then this highlighter from Maybelline, which is so bomb, so bright. Love this one. This is the... 
This is the Diamond Bomb How Many Carrots. And this one is so pretty. This is like, oh my God, you see what I just did? The, oh my gosh, no. Okay, anyways, this is so pretty too. So this is what I use to put on my makeup mostly. Like I said, I'm blind, so I have to do it up close and this actually works for me. I wanna get one of those ones that just sit on your desk with the lights around it. So I'll probably be adding that to my vanity soon here. My palettes um, and my lashes. I use these from Walmart and they are so, so good. This is the only lash I wear at this point and it's like I can use them over and over again and they're so good and they're like three or four dollars. And then I have my Jaclyn Hill palette. Like I said, I do not do my eyes. I am not an eye person. So I rarely, rarely use that. And of course I have my setting spray. This is bomb guys. You cannot go wrong with this. So in my next drawer over here, it has like a, a side compartment where you can split it or you can take this thing out. You literally just slide it up and you can like adjust it to where you want it to go. In this drawer, I just keep my electronic and tech things in here because I don't have anywhere for it to go right now. So this is kind of just like a junk drawer for my like headphones, camera stuff, and like my brush cleaner or whatever. And I also store my pens in here because like I said before, this is also my desk. So I spend a lot of time here writing in my planner and journaling and things also. And then I have all my lipsticks right here. And I'll probably pop these out to show you guys what these are. I love lipstick so much. Even though I don't wear it that much in this point in my life, I still am never getting rid of these because I love lipstick and it just looks cute. So I used to work at Dillard, so I used to just get these on sale and I just like collecting the fun colors and the collections and things. But I haven't been to MAC in so long, but that is like the OG makeup like product. It's like MAC lipsticks, guys. Um, to the makeup department all the time. I love that you know, they just got to play in makeup all day. I was like, that seems like the most fun job ever. So that is what kind of pushed me to become an esthetician. So yeah, that's a little fun fact about it. I just have these stacked and color coordinated in the color field. So this is like pink. Oh my gosh. Like looking at my lipsticks make me just want to do my makeup and just take pictures or something. So these are like pinks, purples, and reds in this one in the first row back here. The OG lip color, Ruby Woo. Oh my gosh, like if you don't have this lipstick, this red lipstick, you're missing out. This is the only one I wear. I don't say the only one, but one of the ones I wear the most. And then I have the Rihanna red one. This one is Ruby Woo, but it's a little bit more matte. And this is Rihanna's. Oh my gosh, I need to stop using this so it never can get old or go away. But <gasps> Rihanna, I love her so much. So the next row, I just have like brown, burgundy brown colors. And like I said, I kind of just have them color coordinated. And I don't know, my lipsticks just make me miss doing my makeup. Like here's purple, that's a good color. And then I have like these crazy, crazy fun colors. Like look at that yellow. Colors that I ain't gonna be wearing. Look, orange, bright orange, so cute, but have no use for that. And then in this one, I just have like some glosses, um, cute packaging ones. This one has a unicorn on it. Oh my gosh, look at that. This one has a unicorn on it and my daughter keeps coming in here and putting it on. Like, girl, this ain't yours. Put my stuff down. This is actually Lime Crime. I don't even know if they still make makeup, but so cute little bottle. My daughter keeps thinking it's hers. So that wraps up my vanity tour, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. You know, just a super chill video to let you guys get to know me a little bit better. And before you leave, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and come back next time for more content.